car phone. Where are we? Tesla showroom. Really? Yep. Yeah. Why? To pick up my new car. Ooh. Our new car. Oh, yeah. Yeah, for your backup keys, the phone is going to be your primary key, but if you don't ever have your phone, whatever reason you need. So to lock and unlock the car with the key cards, you come to the driver's side, you get the key card, you place it right behind the car, underneath the camera, like that. The mirrors will fold, it means the car's locked. Unlock the car, same thing. Brand new camera, unfold. To get in, take your hand, push with your thumb on the large bit, grab with your fingers, and pull it over. I'm sorry, ma'am, I didn't do your name. Teresa. Teresa, Logan, love this media. So to drive then with the key card, you're gonna place it right behind the cup holders on the center console, right there. So get your phone out. And now we will start this process. So hit phone key for me. And then start. There, finishing up. Done, hit done. And then always on, middle off. There you go. So now, cool thing, I'm gonna lock the car. And now all you have to do, Alexander, is just walk up to it and just hit the hand like you were going to get into the car. There it is. Real nice and easy. And then just get in and then you can just drive because your phone is in the vehicle. A couple things on the inside I want to show you guys. Seat controls right here on the side here. You've got an indicator stalk on the left hand side. Then you've got your drive stalk on the right hand side. Up for reverse, down for drive, button in the side for park. Do you guys get autopilots? No. Okay, so no autopilot settings on here. So to activate regular cruise control, you'll be driving along and then you're gonna go down once more on the drive stick like that and then like activate cruise control. On the screen here, you've got this little button at the bottom left of the screen, this little car icon, it'll bring this up to adjust your mirrors and your steering wheel. You're gonna hit mirrors on this screen right here and then use this scroll wheel on the left-hand side. Okay. Now I'm gonna roll it up and down. You see the mirror yep. moving and then push it side to side and we'll move the mirror side to side. Hit right, do the same thing on the right-hand side and then you hit steering wheel, and then it's the same wheel again. Okay. Now it's the steering fine. wheel. Just roll up and down, and move up and down, push it side to side, move it in and out. Real nice and easy. On the doors, guys, you have two buttons. You've got this button right here, which you're gonna use 99% of the time to get in and out of the vehicle. And then you also have this manual release lever right here. Don't pull that unless the car has no power and you're in an emergency situation. Okay. Use the button most of the time. Right. It's Shop. a push button? Yeah, this is, you should just grab the handle, push it. You should hear it, you hear it unlatch. Yeah. Yeah, so that should, then you just push the door. So Logan, um, yeah. does the car, the car have to stay there while you're driving? No, it does not. So once it starts... Once you put the car into drive or reverse, you can move the car. But you don't even need these now that you have that. Right. Yeah. All so right. if I'm driving, will I need an app on, on my phone? To yeah, so all you'll have to do, Teresa, is get your phone. Do you have an iPhone or a smartphone? Yeah. So get your phone, um, log in with Alex's credentials, and then just follow the steps that we just did. The okay. handle is right here. You've got three adapters in here. You've got your 220 adapter. You've got your public charging adapter right here. Any non-Tesla charging station, this is what you'll use. And then your Get this all untangled first. There we go. You're gonna insert this top bit into the top here, just like that. Take it, plug it into the wall. Just like that. Take the cable, thing is open. White Tesla T means I can plug in. I just plug in. It'll go from blue to green in a bit. Give it a sec. There we go. Green means charging, all is well. You just leave it. To unplug, you press and hold this little button on top. Okay. See the little button? The light will go white. And just pull it out. This will close by itself in about six to eight seconds. Three, two, one. Now. <laughs> yeah, so it will close by itself. And that's it, guys. Any other questions? Any questions about it? No. All right. Feel free to hop in, start exploring around, start like fiddling around the screen. Whenever you guys are ready, we're in no rush. We've got paper time. You guys will be done. Yeah. So actually, um, I think
let's see we just got back from the Tesla delivery and the car drives very well very fast good acceleration and we'll be testing out other things in a short while Hi. Okay, we're gonna charge our new Tesla for the very first time. But since we don't have a 240 outlet, we're just gonna have to use the regular home outlet. And it should turn green. Oh, there we go. Now it's charging. Thank you. 